Hey folks, I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. Today, we're gonna have a look at a 2022 Winnebago Hike, model number 172BH. We got bunks in the back, a front U-shaped dinette, outside kitchen, side slide, electric jack, solar, the exoskeleton, whole lot of punch packed into the 17 foot trailer. Weighs around 3,500 pounds, like I said. And I'm with my friend, Brandon Hannemeyer on the camera today. Good morning, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. We all really appreciate it. And please like and subscribe if you enjoy these videos. Helps us know you like it. You got that extra swag on today, oh, eh, yeah. Brandon? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that extra, vo that extra virgin olive oil <laughs> swag, buddy. That's nice <laughs> stuff right there. Power front jack, kind of like our toolbox, propane case, battery case here, 22, 220 pound propane tanks. Your battery is going to go over here. There's space on the other side for another battery. Yeah, looking good, buddy. Thanks, you, you are. <laughs> here we go. We got the exoskeleton, which is going to help protect the trailer, those off-road kind of conditions. Uh, you know, protects the corners, protects the edges, which is great. Six-gallon gas electric water heater, electric jacks. Flip those. You know, turn those up and down from there. Furnace vent, fresh water fill, city water connection. Here's our side slide, pulling parts of our kitchen off the floor. Fridge vent, fridge vent, outside shower, kitchen window. Look at these tires, Brandon. These tires are bigger than my ego, buddy. We got some nice aluminum rims, 15 inch West Lakes, good looking mudder tires, 30 amp detachable style cord right here, cable and satellite inlet. Oh, sorry, I shouldn't say satellite, cable inlet right through there. And there's a nice little bit of bonus storage in here underneath our rear bunks. We got that exoskeleton going on. Uh, we got the rear hitch, which is meant for carrying like a, like a bike rack or a cargo uh, uh, rack, that kind of thing. And then the fiberglass on this guy starts right here at the bottom, goes all the way across the top, down the front, so there's no kind of seams in the roof. Obviously, where the roof fence and stuff like that, there's, there's cutouts there, but there's no corner molds or, or you know, kind of bridges between the rubber and the fiberglass, which is fantastic. So one piece all the way across the front. Love that. Two burner stove top, a sink that's plumbed in, uh, like a hot and cold kind of thing. You have to drain it like this to dump it out, but still a pretty handy sink here on the outside. We still got an exoskeleton. We got these nice fender flares. All right, the width on this trailer is six and a half feet wide when you're going down the road, which makes it nice and nimble, fit in those tight spots, easy to look around, that kind of thing. But we still have the secure stance with that full eight feet wide with the tires, making it nice and easy to pull. Electric awning right here, covers our main door. Uh, lend a hand grab handle, two step entry, black water flush kit, outside receptacle, and then we got the slingshot, Brandon. Doesn't get more dramatic than that. Also, our storage is right here. Looking good there, buddy. Fantastic. Let's have a look inside. Mm -hmm. Right on, folks. We're inside that. 172 BH. I'm sitting here in this huge U-shaped dinette. It's a very deep U-shaped dinette. You're probably getting six people around here, I would say. Uh, very, very comfortable here. I got nice windows on both sides of me, a nice shelf here above me, and four lights right in this area, really making this area very bright. This is going to be your main bed. So you're going to pop this table down, and then you're going to use these uh, end cushions here to fill up the gaps. Uh, which makes it to your nice big main bed. It is 74 inches long, so an RV queen length. Uh, I didn't check the width. We can do that for you, but definitely 74 inch long bed, which is fantastic. Our main uh, door is right in through this way. All right, we got ourselves like a spot to charge your cell phone. We got some great kind of uh, cupboard space here. The, the, the hidden hinges, the lighter kind of cabinetry in here is fantastic. Our TV is across from that U-shaped dinette. Our radios right here, our switches for everything are all through here. Uh, I mentioned gas, electric water heater, which is going on here. And then we have tank heaters as well. So 12 volt tank heaters below the trailer on our actual blankets, which is fantastic. As we get into the kitchen here, we have our convection micro. We have our three cubic foot gas electric fridge. This is out in the slide. I love this kind of slate covered doors we got across the top in through here. There's no hardware to worry about. You just grab the actual handles, which is slick. Uh, kitchen window, undermount two burner stove top, undermount stainless steel sink with a pull out faucet. And then we're gonna have a whack of storage in here as well. So keep in mind, 17 foot trailer with bunks. So a lot of storage in here when you consider that. 
that goes in a way there. And then uh, let's take a minute to appreciate this wicked floor. I love the texture on it. It's not going to look dirty because it is so textured. Um, you know, looks very durable. Nice stuff. Sink cover right through here as well. It just fits right in. That's slick. And then here's our pantry space. And then a couple more drawers here down below as well. Now behind me, behind me we got the bunks. These are big bunks, wouldn't you say, Brandon? Yeah, they are very wide. Yeah, very wide. They'll be the, the 74 inch length, so you should be able to fit in here. You know, I'm a, I'm a bigger boy, right? And I can fit in here very comfortably, okay? Uh, there's a light in here, there's a set of windows on either side of me, and then at the top bunk, let's see what's going on up there, ow. Um, we got windows on both sides of that bunk too. So very airy bunk room, which is, which is really fantastic. We got USBs in this top bunk too. And then maybe on the bottom bunk, what do we got? Okay. So just the top USB, so you have to share those, you know, first row problems right on into the washroom. Got ourselves a squat check. The dump truck fits, barely fit into these pants, but the dump truck fits storage right through there. Stainless steel sink. Medicine cabinet slash linen cabinet and a nice long mirror right through there. Can't quite get all of Brandon's big body, but nice mirror right through there. I'm six feet tall. How do I fit? Not quite, eh? I could shower here though. I just have to be a little bit bent over. Um, I do have shoes on and my head's a little bit in the sky here, but pretty decent shower right on. Anything else you want to say, Brendan? No, I think this is a nice little floor. Yeah, I think it's pretty slick. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel, share that with your friends. Then you can email us here at sales at lazyacres.com. Have yourself a good day.